In this video, we will find the current of a circuit using Thevenin's theorem. So that is the given circuit and voltage source is 10 volt. And these are the resistances with 5 ohm as the load resistor. And we have to find the current through this load resistor 5 ohm. So for using Thevenin's theorem, the first step is to find the Thevenin voltage. So that is VTH. We have to find this. To find the Thevenin voltage, we have to open this load resistor. So open this load. And after opening this load resistor, the circuit will be like this. That is 10 volt, that is 3 ohm, 3 ohm, 6 ohm. And now the voltage appearing across these terminals is called Thevenin voltage. Now, there, since these terminals are open, there will be no current flow in this 3 ohm. So the vo voltage appearing across this 6 ohm resistor would be same as appearing across these terminals. So we will get Thevenin voltage after getting voltage across this 6 ohm resistor. So find the voltage across 6 ohm. By voltage divider rule, it will be 10 into 6 divided by sum of the resistor. That is 3 plus 6. So that's equals to 10 into 6 by 9. That's equals to 20 by 3 volt. And this is the Thevenin voltage. That is 20 by 3 volt. Okay. Now, we have to find the second step. That is to find the Thevenin resistance. RTH and to find the Thevenin resistance we have to short the voltage source so after shorting this source the circuit will be like this one ok that is 3 that is 3 now the resistance across this terminal is called Thevenin resistance so to find the resistance across these two terminals now this 3 and 6 are in parallel connection so the equivalent resistance may be replaced there so that is 3 ohm and the equivalent resistance of 3 and 6 will be 3 into 6 divided by 3 plus 6 that is equals to 18 by 9 that is equals to 2 so the equivalent resistance there is 2 ohm and that is Thevenin resistance across this ok now this 3 ohm and 2 ohm resistor are in series connection so we can replace this with a single resistor and the value is the sum of the two resistor that is 5 thus we get the Thevenin resistance that is 5 ohm now step 3 to draw the Thevenin equivalent circuit and the Thevenin equivalent circuit is like the Thevenin voltage connected with the Thevenin resistance in series with the load resistor in series ok and we have already found the value of VTH that is Thevenin voltage is from there that is 20 by 3 volt and value of the Thevenin resistor is 5 ohm and value of the load resistor is given in the problem that is 5 ohm ok now we have to find the current through this load resistor ok so the current in this circuit is given by IL that's equals to total voltage that is 20 by 3 that is V Thevenin divided by the total resistance that is RTH plus RL that's equals to value of Thevenin voltage is given by 20 by 3 and R Thevenin is given by 5 R load is given by 5 so that is 20 by 3 divided by 10 that's equals to 2 by 3 thus we get the load current that is 2 by 3 ampere okay in this way 
using Thevenin's theorem we get the value of the current across the load.